In today's video, we will cover CSM listings in Business Central. Now for testing purposes, we are going to use the CSM channel, BigCommerce. Now to begin this item mapping series, we're going to start off by creating an item in Business Central. As you can see, here is an example of an item that has been created. This is the item cart that we're viewing. Now, there are two ways in which you can create a CSM listing. For example, Listing Wizard is a step-by-step -step process that walks you through the creation of a CSM listing record for a single business central record. Second option is from business central items import. This allows you to create multiple CSM listing records for a group of business central records. Now for the first step in creating, list, creating listings with the listing wizard, we're going to open the CSM sales channel record for which you want to create listings. We're going to choose listing and the navigation ribbon, and then we're going to choose wizard. Now we're going to enter in the item number, and we're gonna look this up, and we're going to choose the item that we've created, and you can choose a variant, item variant code if you've created one. Select OK, and then unit of measure will default. You'll hit Next, and then you will see the sales channel SKU code that has been populated. Then you're going to click Next, and then you're going to click Finish. A new listing record is created for the sales channel based on the values that were entered in the wizard. Now, in order to create listings with Business Central item imports, you're going to select Related and the Navigation ribbon, Listings, and then we're going to choose Channel Listings, or in this case, Create Listing. And then you're going to choose from Business Central items. You're going to select your CSM sales channel, unit of measure, and then you're going to select the SKU number. Now, select the method by which sales channel SKU values will be assigned to new CSM listing records. A sales channel SKU identifies the CSM listing as a unique record for the CSM sales channel sales channel queues can be assigned from a combination of an item, number, variant, and unit of measure, item identifier, or barcode values. If you only wish to create the CSM listing records for a selected group of items, set the necessary filters on the filter item fast tab. Then you're going to click OK. records are created for the sales channel according to the criteria that you specified in the Create CSM listing from Business Central Items page. To view all of the channel listings that have been created, you're going to choose Listing in the Navigation ribbon and then Channel Listings.
here you can see the listing for the Sweet Engine dog sweater that we've created. Keep in mind within the listing product information, you must update your description information. To do this, you can click Manage, View, and Edit. You want to make sure that your tag is set to a long description, which this should default. And you also want to make sure that your source type is blob. Here in the description, you'll list what you wish to list on your production website or production store. And this is how it will display on your online store. And remember, in order to send this information to your online store, you're going to send this information by selecting Actions in the, in the Navigation ribbon, and then you're going to choose Channel Integration. From there, you're going to send listing-based information to the channel. Once that information has successfully been sent over to your online store, you will automatically receive an, an external ID. And also you'll see in your update status, it will show as success. Now be sure to tune in to our next video to this item mapping series to get complete information on how to map certain things within Business Central. Be sure to view that next video, Create Item Identifier for item mapping. Thank you for watching this video. Be sure to subscribe, like, and comment to our Sweet Engine YouTube channel.